Right, challenge time. Let's see if you can do this challenge. So this is the challenge for fragments and recycler view. So what I want you to do in this application is to, to use these pictures. So you can get the pictures by going to this website, the bit.ly, and then images car. So if you open up that web page, or you open up that link, it will take you to a Google Drive car images.zip file, which you can download then. Okay, so that is to get the images. So what do you need to do for this application? So you'll see that I've got for every car that's listed inside of list, this list view or this recycler view, you will see that we have the make of the car, the model of the car, the owner of the car, and then also for the owner information, there's also a telephone number. So you'll need to go and create a custom class that will have the make of the vehicle the model of the vehicle as well as the owner of the vehicle and then an extra field there also for the telephone number of the owner now uh, the recycler view this is then the recycler view make sure you use the card view with the recycler view and then this one will be a fragment this part at the top for the two buttons will be a fragment and then we'll have a fragment at the bottom as well so you'll see that if i click on car info it shows me the picture, basically the make and the model of the specific vehicle where you clicked. So that must work when you click on car info. And then if you go to owner info, it shows another fragment again. So you can see that I'm showing a fragment. If I click on car info, I'm showing this fragment and hiding the owner info fragment. And then if I click on owner info, I'm hiding the car info fragment and I'm showing the owner info fragment. Okay, so in the car info, basically just the picture there of which type of car or the, the make of the car and then the model of the car. If I click on owner information, it is the name of the owner and the telephone number of the owner. So let's see if you can get this one to work. Uh, if you're having problems after this video, I'll do the solution. Good luck.